Hello, my pickles! You asked for it, you've got it! You can't see him, but I can. Greg is right behind me with that steady Eddie camera, just excelling in zooming into these products that I'm going to be showing you. This is so much fun. So, I just came home from shopping, and I've got a grocery haul to show you. Um, Greg did some, I did some. Tons of good stuff here. All keto friendly. So, are you ready? First of all, this came from BJ's, so it, I didn't get it today. I got it a couple of days ago. This is the coconut oil I use for all of my cooking. I use the Calapo, which I showed you in my coffee one for coffees, but this is what I do all my cooking in. And when you're looking for a coconut oil, what you want, unrefined, cold pressed, organic, what's the other one? There's a fourth one. Um, organic, extra virgin, cold pressed, and unrefined, unrefined, because refined just means it's been processed more, and um, you don't want that. You want the unrefined, even though, you know, we like to think that we're refined, right? Because if you are, we, we so I got that, a tub of that a couple of days ago. These are organic green beans. 85 grams equals 3 ounces. There are 5 carbohydrates and 3 carbs of um, fiber. So when I have them, I'm now counting out the 85 grams, which I did yesterday to have them. And they're good. The grass fed butter. This is another favorite at our house. These are the Florentines that um, I had talked about before, but this is the show and tell. It is made with cheese and spinach, little pinwheels, we call them pinwheels, delicious. And here's the deal, five ounces is 210 calories, one carbohydrate, who knew? So, they're delicious. I got some of them today at Market Basket, don't you know? Also, some party wings. These are um, almost a pound and a half, and they will serve the two of us quite handily. So I will start marinating them and cook them up like Tuesday or Wednesday. I got uh, 12 ounces of classic cut farmland, all natural, uncured, hickory, smoked, bacon. No artificial ingredients or preservatives, no steroids or hormones, product of the USA. Okay, zero carbs, which means zero sugar, two strips, 90 calories. We like that because it's thick cut too. Two packages of cauliflower crumbles that um, we cook in olive oil or um, organic olive oil and the coconut oil in a cast iron lodge pan on the big green egg. Those will be cooked in a little while. <clears throat> a pound of grass-fed um, beef and it is 240 calories in four ounces. This is the 8515, zero carbs, 21 grams of protein. is Letty's. It is um, fresh pork raised with no antibiotics ever, no added hormones ever, and so this is a rack of ribs. And so I will be partially cooking them today, and then Greg will finish them off on the big green egg that have all the chips of whatever flavor he uses. It could be apple, it could be cherry, it could be hickory. But, and then we'll have these for a dinner. This is um, blue cheese, Danish blue. Um, I had a hankering for this in a romaine salad. One ounce is 100 calories, and it has zero carbs. Um, so, I will be having that on a chopped romaine and organic olive oil salad at some point. Sour cream. Oops, sorry, did I go too fast? No, it's good. Then, um, 
pasture-raised organic valley Neuchatel cheese and two tablespoons, it's organic, two tablespoons is um, 70 calories, which I love, zero carbs. And if you haven't put cream cheese or Neuchatel in your organic egg omelet, you're missing out on a slice of heaven. Organic Valley Culture Pastured um, Artesian Craft Butter. This is what I put in my teas and my Bulletproof Coffee. It's delicious. We never use antibiotics, synthetic hormones, toxic pesticides, or GMOs. $3.69 at Market Basket. A dozen extra large Pete and Jerry eggs. You all see these, they're all over the United States. Organic, free range, no pesticides, added hormones, no antibiotics, and no GMOs. And these are extra large. So in one egg, there are 80 calories, 7 grams of protein, 5 grams of fat. What else do you need to know? <coughs> packages of asparagus which we will be cooking on the big green egg today um, in aluminum foil packets with olive oil. I'm going to keep some out so I can roast them and let me see one cup is 134 grams 27 calories there are five carbs in that and 2.8 fiber even three grams of protein so that's pretty cool. We have two packs of those and we eat those all the week long. This is the Raos, um, this is the Arabata sauce that I was telling you about, but one of the best things about this and their pizza sauce is the low carbs. It's the lowest carb I've found so far. In a half a cup, there are three carbs and one gram of fiber. So um, this is going to be a staple in our house. and. Um, that's why that's got that show and tell. And tomorrow it will be going on the zoodles. And I know that Stephanie Keto person said no squashes. Um, but I like them. And with the sauce on them and my keto meatballs, yeah. So 85, or 85 grams, which I will have tomorrow, 15 calories, 3 carbs, and 1 carb, 1 gram of fiber. So, um, and 85 grams, it's about a quarter of this. This is a pretty heavy um, package here. And then Greg will have the rest. And I saute it in a little bit of olive oil. Um, I just don't add the sauce to it. First I kind of soften, soften this and give it a little um, organic olive oil taste. Before lemons, I put lemons and uh, half a lemon and some Lakewood organic lemon juice in my in my water to have with my vitamins and you know in between meals and, and so forth. This was what we had last week. They only had one there at Market Basket today. Bison ribeye steak. And so it is grass fed. Five ounces, which is 142 grams, 15 um, 15 grams of fat, so it's 240 calories and 28 grams of uh, protein. So, oh, so good. This is a 10 ounce package and um, raised without antibiotics, no added hormones. Delicious. And I'm sorry they only had one. So, that will be for next week. Hopefully I can find a twin for it. And then this is our go-to for tonight. These are grass-fed beef ribeye from Spring Crossing, just like the um, ground beef. Four ounces, 113 grams, has 310 calories, 21 grams of protein, 25 grams of fat. And we love fat if you're doing keto. So um, no artificial ingredients, minimally processed, aged a minimum of 21 days, excellent flavor, comes from Australia and um, you know countries other than the United States do less to their meats than we do so these are great 
and um, they're both nine tenths of a pound so we will have leftovers with these and I will probably do my sauteed spinach and organic mushrooms bed with the leftover on top. This is the organic broccoli slaw from uh, Taylor Farms and it has in it 85 grams is one cup, 25 calories, 5 grams of carbohydrate, 3 grams of fiber. I, so that's kind of good and it's organic so that would make my um, crack slaw that I'm totally addicted to with the pound of grass-fed beef that I previously showed. This is the Heavy Whipping Cream Organic Valley and it, no GMOs, antibiotics, toxic pesticides, or synthetic hormones. And this is what I buy for my coffee. I've also bought it at Whole Foods. Um, I did get a Horizon Organic um, pint of heavy whipping cream as well last week, but I just got this at Market Basket, so it's show and tell time. These came from Star, two, two packages of organic white mushrooms which will go into that little sautéed either spinach or kale um, leftover meal that we do. Or it could go into an omelet too because those are planned. These are scallions that I plan for my omelet as well. Just cute little scallions and I bought them at the Brazilian place that I went to last week. Sabolina Pocada. But to you and me it's scallions. Then I got a three pack of um, Foxy Organic Lettuce. <clears throat> wow, they don't even print how many whatever whatevers. Um, so there's three, three of them and it's organic and that's all I needed to know when I purchased it. And then we got three packages of organic Brussels sprouts. Okay. Those are going to be going into the big cast iron pan with the olive oil and the coconut oil. And um, so it's three pounds of them, organic, and they come from Mexico. So Greg found these last week, and um, yeah, they're good, organic. I've never seen them until last week when he brought them home. And then a big tub, um, 11 ounces of Olivia's organic spinach and in two cups 85 grams 20 calories three carbs and two carbs of those are fiber and they are loaded vitamin k which is a, a vitamin that we we all need a lot of 510 percent folate 40 magnesium 15 and those are what um a lot of americans are missing in their food plan so got that then a great big old Olivia's Organic Baby Kale, same thing, big one. And in two cups, 85 grams, there's 40 calories, and there are seven grams of carbs, and three carbs are fiber. Um, vitamin K, even more, 750% in two cups. Vitamin C is 107 folate 30%, magnesium 10, and even calcium 15. So what you're giving up um, <clears throat> in the folate, in the magnesium, you're gaining in the vitamin C. So good deal. So we saute that a lot as we do the spinach. Oh, and then another thing of Olivia's spinach. So this this bounty here is concluded, and um, we didn't have to sell the house to get it all. But, you know, when you start eating this way, you eat less. Um, it's better for you. And um, to have elegance at your meal and to have really healthy, nutritious, that's the best part about keto, is that a great piece of meat and a great green vegetable that's organic, what more can you ask for? Um, so that concludes our little grocery haul. Thanks so much for watching. This has been Sarah Pearls of Wisdom and Food with Keto Under 20, especially today on Steak Night with Greg the Cameraman who got more response than I did and you can't even see him.